Kolla noga för det vi ser här händer inte ofta. Ungefär 13 gånger per 100 år för att vara specifik. Här ser vi Mercurius passera solen. Fenomenet är viktigt för Nasas arbete och för vår förståelse av solsystemet. Uh, the transits are very important to us because it's actually something that has been used by astronomers for hundreds, hundreds of years to understand our solar system, how far our planets are from our sun, you know, the atmosphere of our planets. Mellan klockan 12 minuter över 1 och 29 på kvällen kunde vi i Sverige se planeten passera mellan jorden och solen. And they use that system to find planets outside our solar system, the exoplanets, and see if they can understand those planets, the atmosphere, and if they actually can find some kind of life form in them. Och den synliga passagen studeras av NASA med de här kamerorna. Well, this transit is actually going to be used mostly to calibrate instrumentation from the Solar Dynamic Observatory cameras, which is, like I said, the highest resolution mission that we have right now to look at our sun. And that's pretty important because the sun causes what is called space weather, which is something that can affect us here on Earth. Um, however, you know, we actually are trying to find planets outside our solar system to understand our universe, to understand if we can find planets that can have some kind of life form in them. Om du missade den här passagen kommer en ny chans om tre år. 2019 passerar Mercurius återigen mellan solen och jorden.